Now that your firmware is up to date, go to www.hotspotpa.com. Click the login link in the upper right hand corner. Enter your login ID and password. The initial page after login is Operator Configuration. Here, you will verify that your company's information is correct. Portions of it may be visible on customers' pages. Verify Visitors Mode. Default is open. If closed is selected, your customers will not be allowed to use other operators' hotspots. Verify Demonstration Mode. If on, no charges are made to credit cards or PayPal accounts. For testing, use this MasterCard number. Name, address, expiration date, and security code can be anything. Next, click Account Types in the left side nav panel. An account type is a template that is used to generate a customer's account. This specifies the price your hotspot will charge customers and how long the customer can use your hotspot before having to renew their account. An account type can be deleted if no customers are using it. Create several different account types for your customers to select from. Now, select Customers. Click Edit next to a customer to view or change their settings. Select Logins next to a customer to view their login logout history. Check the Passwords box to view their passwords. Then, click New Customer. When creating a new customer, your login ID will change to the customer's ID when entering the payment pages. Log out and log back in to become yourself again. New customers can create their own login. You don't need to do it for them. Select Hotspots in the left side nav panel. Select Update Addresses to obtain the most recent public and VPN addresses for your routers. Click Refresh next to a hotspot to update the hotspot statistics. Click Console to proxy to the administration console web interface running on your router. This can be used to change parameters held in the router such as the wireless SSID or the device ID. If you have changed the router's password, you must enter the new password into the box beneath the left side navbar. This permits the refresh button to collect statistics or to use the console link. Now, click Payments. Here you will see six variations of your customer's payment status. Status Accepted, which means payment accepted and credited to customer's account. Status Cleared, customer payment cleared the Hotspot PA Bank. Status Ready, payment is ready to be made on the next monthly payout cycle. Status Paid, payout made to operator. Status Disputed, payment is disputed by customer. The customer box above the left side nav panel always shows which customer is being edited. The links at the top of the page, Home, News, About, and Contact, can be changed using the Operator Settings page to point to your own website. The color scheme of the web pages can be changed using the Operator Settings page. You will need to log out, then log in again for the changes to be visible. The Hotspot PA logo can be changed to your own logo using the Operator Settings page. In order to be viewable by your customers, you must provide a copy of your logo to Hotspot PA so that it can be installed on Hotspot PA's login servers. Your logo should be a GIF or JPEG image, 240 by 120. Thanks for choosing Hotspot PA for your internet Wi-Fi hotspot.